What's up everybody, my name is Michael Rizzi and I'm wearing a rainbow headband because why not? Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna be telling you guys how you can get Twitter verified. Now, if you're new to my channel and you don't really wanna hear me ramble, you just wanna learn how you can get Twitter verified, I will leave the time code for where I start talking about that right down below, it's right here. I got Twitter verified in July, 2016. And the same day that I got Twitter verified, I got Instagram verified. Getting Instagram verified is a totally separate story. I had already been Instagram verified. I was over the moon uh, and I was actually at dinner with my parents and my boyfriend and I'm sitting there. I just go to my Twitter page and all of a sudden I had a blue check and I was like, oh my God, it worked. What I did actually got me Twitter verified and I don't think a lot of people know about this. Like it's weird to me that people didn't hear about it because I heard about it on Twitter uh, and it was a big deal for like an hour or two and then it went away and no one talked about it since. And the people that I've told had no idea that you could do this. Also, if you're watching this video and you're like, oh, why, why would I ever wanna get Twitter verified? Getting verified is like, I think really important for a lot of people. It, I think it raises a lot of your value on Twitter. Um, if you're someone who enjoys networking with people for jobs, the blue check mark definitely gives you a lot of credibility on Twitter. And then if you're like me and you're just a social media addict, Having the blue check mark is awesome for a variety of reasons. Generally, it's just cool to have the blue check mark, but more importantly, when you get verified, you get another column in your mentions. Under your interactions, you have one column that has everything. You have another column that just has mentions, and when you get verified, you have another column that is all the interactions from other verified accounts. That's really cool because if you want to interact with like a celebrity who is verified, um, you have a much better chance of like actually getting noticed by them, which is kind of cool. I posted a tweet last week and Ariana Grande actually liked it because I, I, I at replied her and I guess she liked it because she's verified, I'm verified, and it's much easier to find my tweet. Okay, so there is gonna be a link in the description bar down below that leads to Twitter's open verification application form. And you're gonna go to the link, it's gonna pop up. If you're already logged into your Twitter, it'll already be set up for you. Your Twitter handle will be on the page. There's gonna be a little box at the bottom that's gonna say, check this if you're a business or a brand or an organization. If you're not, don't click that box because in my opinion, they have so many applications to go through and if they find out that you lied and they're like, well, this person is not a brand, they're not a, a company, they're just gonna throw out your application. So just don't lie. You don't need to be a brand or an organization to get verified. So don't click that check mark if you're not. After that, you're basically gonna have to list all the areas online that you exist. So whether that be Instagram, if you have a YouTube channel, if you have a public Facebook page, List all of those, and they're gonna have like five options, I believe, to, to, to list those. What I did, and I think what made mine stand apart, is the fact that while I did put all the traditional social media, I also put my Much Digital Studios page. For those of you who don't know, I'm Much Creator with Much, and so my videos, my pictures, my name exists on another website that is not traditional social media, and I think that's really important because I think they're looking to verify people that have let's say like a business or their name exists on other platforms that are not the traditional social media. If you guys have your own like photography company, if you have your own photography website, if you have any other website that has your name on it, put that. Let's say you're in high school and you're the president of the debate team and that is linked on the school's website, put that. Like anything that has your name that says there is a possibility that someone would imitate me, that is incentive for them to verify you. And you know what? If you don't have another website, just try it anyways. And I'm sure you have a really good chance of actually getting verified. Once you've done all that, there's going to be a box at the bottom of the screen that's basically going to be like, hey, why should we verify you? In that box, I would definitely talk about why getting verified improves your brand and your credibility. Think about it in Twitter's perspective, like they're verifying people because people can be imitated, um, there can be fake accounts, and so you wanna definitely use words like credibility, I wanna make sure that the people who follow me know that I am the real me. So it definitely worked for me, I did it in the very beginning and I think I got verified within five to six days. I know some other people who have yet to get verified from that form. I know some people who it took two weeks. So I think it really varies and I think they have a lot of applicants right now. But if you haven't already done this, I would urge you to do it because 
I could see them closing it sometime in the future just because I think they're gonna get a lot of applications. So once again, the link for the open application form is in the description bar down below. Like I've said before, it's a twitter.com link. This is not some random third party link. You're someone that wants to get verified. I hope this video helped you. If you're new to my channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button. I make weekly videos that are super, super gay. If you enjoyed this video and it helped you possibly get verified, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. It really gives me warm feelings in my heart, wherever that is. I don't know, because I fail biology. All right, I love you guys. Make sure to comment, rate, subscribe, most importantly, smile. I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys. I love a challenge. A weekend trip in Montreal, a $150 spending limit, count me in. So I just came here from Ottawa, and get this, I got here for $33. That's awesome, because this weekend, I'm gonna be here on a budget.